Hello kids. Happy morning to you all. Hope you all are safe. Children, we know that there are thousands of things around us made from different substances. Whether it can be natural or man-made. For example, in our daily life, we are using so many things, eating food, breathing air, drinking water, right? But can you observe anything common to all of them? That is, they all occupy space and have weight. For example, hold your box or any other things in your hand. You can feel the weight of the box. Right? Now place it on the table. So now you can find your box occupies some space on the table. Right? This is because all the things have weight and occupy space. Anything that has weight and occupies space is called matter. As children, everything around you is made of matter. So now tell me what is matter? Anything that has weight and occupies space is called matter. Everything around you is made of matter. They just in different shapes and forms. Matter exists in three forms. They are solid, liquid and gas. These three forms are called states of matter. Yes children, for today our topic is about states of matter. Children now tell me what are the three states of matter? Solid, liquid and gas. Children you know our body is made of bones, tissues and various fluids. Similarly Matter is also made of very tiny particles called molecules. What are they? Molecules. Molecules are so tiny that cannot be seen with the naked eye. The way the molecules are arranged in a substance determines the state of matter. Molecules in solids are tightly packed giving them a definite shape and a fixed volume. In liquids the molecules are loosely packed such that they do not have a definite shape but do have a fixed volume. This is the reason why liquids flow and take the shape of the container. In gases, the molecules are very loosely arranged. Gases have no definite shape 
and fixed volume they occupy all the available space gases can be squeezed that is compressed in specially created metallic cylinders we observe this in liquefied petroleum gas that is lpg and compressed natural gas that is cng cylinders now let's see the three states of matter in more detail water is present in all the three states for example solid that is ice liquid that is water and gas that is water vapor solids solids are substances that are usually hard and have a definite shape and size look at your science book it has a fixed shape whether it is kept on a table or on a chair it does not change its shape and occupies the same amount of space anywhere you put it you can easily pick up an apple because it is a solid it is possible to throw and catch a ball because it is a solid you can keep and carry things in boxes or bags because they are solid solids are generally easy to pick carry or move around except when they are huge chair car fan vegetables fruits or a house or few examples of solids they have fixed shape they do not change their shape when you move it or put it in a container they also have same weight this is because molecules in solids are tightly packed giving them a fixed shape and a fixed volume but solids can change their shape only when an external force is applied for example it is changed its shape when it is smashed broken tad and so on some solids are elastic for example rubber bands they stretch when pulled and they return to their original shape when released uses of solids in our lives all living things depend on various forms of matter to live we eat food such as vegetables 
fruits pulses and food grains or example of solids we live in homes that are built with materials such as bricks stone cement and so on that are solids metals ceramics wood and so on are used to manufacture things for our daily use we wear clothes made from fabrics like cotton silk satin and so on which are solids liquids liquids are substances that have a definite quantity that is volume but have no fixed shape liquids do not have their own shape but they take the shape of the container in which they are kept or poured we get water through water pipes and taps and we store in bottles liquids flow and can be carried around only when they are filled in a container which means we cannot take liquids just like solid thick liquids flow a little slower than thin liquids such as honey and milk consider lemonade as example lemonade takes the shape of the container in which it was poured it has no shape of its own lemonade is made from lemon anything that does not have a fixed shape can be poured easily and can flow is a liquid for another example pour a cup of water on the floor it will spread but it will not cover the entire floor or room liquids will always flow downwards or sideways do you know why this is because the molecules present in liquids or arrangement loosely so that they can move or spread easily and also can be poured children now tell me what is matter s anything that has weight and occupy space is called matter what are the three states of matter s solid liquid and gas 
examples for solid book table chair and so on examples for liquid water milk juice and so on example for gas water vapor air and so on all matter is made up of molecules why do solids have fixed shape and occupy space because the presence of molecules in solids are tightly packed why are liquids do not have fixed shape because molecules are loosely packed in liquids right s then what about the gas it has very loosely arrangement of molecules that is why they can move around and spread easily right children s kids now let's start to write class work so take your evs class work now we are going to start a new lesson no so first you have to finish your index page serial number 7 and write today date and write again the lesson number 7 states of matter once you finish your writing index turn your class work to new page now write l in capital n 7 s in capital t a t e n s states o f of m in capital a t t e r matter lesson 7 states s t a t e s states of o f of matter m a t t e r matter lesson 7 states of matter now let's start to write the first roman d words so write d in capital hyphen w in capital o r d s words first one is d words first one is m a t t e r matter number 2 E V A P O R A T I O N evaporation
Number three. C O N D E N S A T I O N condensation number 4 M E L T I N G melting and number 5 F R E E Z I N G freezing right children now write number 6 S O L I D solid number 7 C O N V E R S I O N conversion number 8 W A T E R water V A P O U R vapor water vapor and write number 9 S T A T E S states and the last one number 10 is L I Q U I and D liquid children lesson number 7 states of matter right and the first roman is d words d words means you know dictation words first one is matter m a t t e r matter second one is evaporation e v a p o r a t i o n evaporation third one is condensation c o n d e n s a t i o n condensation fourth one is melting m e l t i n g melting fifth one is freezing f r e e z i n g freezing and the sixth one is solid s o l i d solid seventh one is conversion c o n v e r s i o n conversion eighth one is water vapor w a t e r water v a p o u r vapor water vapor ninth one is states s t a t e s states liquid tenth one is liquid l i q u i d liquid so children copy and write the 10 d words in your class book so shall we move to the next pattern s write second roman w in capital r i t e write t r u e true o r r f in capital a 
L S E false right children first one is M in capital A T T E R matter E X I S T S exist I N in F O U R for F O R M S forms now write the answer F in capital A L S E false and underline the word false second one is s in capital o l i d s solids d o do n o t not h a v E have A A D E F I N I T E definite S H A P E shape full stop F in capital a l s e false now write number 3 l in capital i q u i d s liquids t a K E take T H E the S H A P E shape O F of T H E the C O N T A I N E R container T H E Y De A R E R pod P O U R E D port I N T O into full stop and now write the answer T in capital R U E true and underline the word true now write number 4 and write s in capital t e a m steam i s e s a n n e x a m p l e example O F of G A S full stop gas T in capital R U E true
second pattern is write w or write t e write t r u e true o or or f a l s e false write true or false first one is m a t t e or matter e x i s t s exists i n in f o u or for f o r m s forms answer is false f a l s false second one is s o l i d s solids d o do n o t not h a v e have a d e f i n i t e definite s h a p e shape the answer is f a l s e false third one is l i q u i d s liquids t a k e take t h e the s h a p e shape o f of t h e the c o n t a i n e r container t h e y the a r e r p o u r e d pot i n t o into the answer is true t r u e true and the last one is s t e a m steam i s e s a n n e x a m p l e example o f of g a s gas the answer is true t r u e true second pattern is write true or false first one is matter exist in four forms answer is false second one is solids do not have a definite shape the answer is false and the third one is liquids take the shape of the container they or poured into answer is true the last one is steam is an example of gas the answer is true right children s now write a third pattern m in capital a t c h match t h e the f o l l o w i n g following first one is e in capital v a p o r a t i o n evaporation hyphen w in capital a t e r water d r o p s drops o n on 
C O L D cold D R I N K drink B O T T L E bottle Now write number 2 C in capital O N D E N S A T I O N condensation hyphen S in capital T E A M steam F R O M from B O I L I N G boiling W A T E R water right number 3 F in capital R E E Z I N G freezing hyphen again I I in capital C E ice C H A N G I N G changing T O 2 W A T E R water fourth one M in capital E L T I N G melting hyphen again w in capital a t e r water c h a n g i n g changing T O 2 I C E ice first one evaporation answer is steam from boiling water so write number 1 here second one is condensation answer for this water drops on cold drink bottle right number 2 third one is freezing answer for this third one water changing to ice so right number 3 fourth one is melting answer is ice changing to water so right number is 4 Right, children. S. Third pattern is match the following. First one is evaporation. Answer is steam from boiling water. Right, number one. Second one is. condensation answer 
water drops on cold drink bottle so right number 2 third one is freezing answer for this water changing to ice so right number 3 last fourth one is melting for this answer ice changing to water so right number 4 okay children copy and write this third pattern in your class work thank you children